Rick Santorum has a new line of attack that he's using against liberals now. He's mocking diversity. Again, it's it's the silly idea and notion. And I I remember being at a uh, at a debate with Howard Dean at Northwestern a couple of years ago, and and we were asked a question by a student: What's the greatest uh, uh, virtue of the United States of America? You know what Howard Dean said? Diversity. <laughs> And this is, but that's what they believe. They believe that America will be better off if we bring in people that are nothing like and, and share none of the values of what, what made America the unique and great country. And, and let's be honest. I mean, you know, if you look at, at, at radical Islam, it's about as antithetical to the American first principles as anything you'd, look, you'd want to see. But in, the, in, the Obama's, in, in, in President Obama's mind, that's a good thing for America because, of course, America is flawed. Totally made it up. <laughs> Totally. Yeah, the liberals like diversity. Radical Islam, they like. Obama's trying to bring them here. Ha! Ah, ha! Ah, what an idiot! Ah, ah. Except he never said that. Point me to one quote, show me one video where President Obama says, I would like to bring in radical Islamists to America. You're not gonna find it. You wanna know why? He didn't fucking say it. But see, what's so funny about this is, what's Rick Santorum? Rick Santorum is a radical Christian. He's a fundamentalist Christian. He's a guy who wants to get rid of abortion. He's a guy who has said in the past he wants to get rid of birth control. So here's a guy who has a lot in common with radical Islamists. And he's mocking them. He's like, oh, yeah, radical Islamists, they're crazy. Look at these religious fundamentalists. They're so kooky. They don't believe in facts. How about you, Ricky? It's so clear that you're in the same boat as them. You agree more with radical Muslims than you agree with liberals. For sure, for sure. So, uh, what's funny is, his beliefs are also antithetical to the American way. Now, I believe in multiculturalism, I believe in diversity. But we should only be, uh, we can't be tolerant of intolerance. So, in other words, you can have multiculturalism as long as the cultures agree on some very basic things, like freedom of speech, freedom of expression, constitutional rights, things of that nature, personal autonomy. And what's clear is, <laughs> Radical Islamists do not believe in those things, and radical Christians do not believe in those things. Fundamentalists do not believe in those things. So that, from that perspective, he's actually right about one thing, but he's included in his own criticism. He's right that American culture, open society, freedom, democracy, is not something that can coexist next to radical religion of any sort. But the thing is, he's, he's in that as well. See, the United States is secular. And the United States is a democracy. So, it is beautiful when you look around and you see all different races, all different religions, all different belief systems. But those belief systems, you can't have somebody who comes to the U.S. and says, well, now we're going to make this a Christian nation. Now we're going to implement Christian Sharia. Or a radical Muslim that says, now we're going to implement Sharia. Well, then that would be antithetical to the U.S. But that's not... But that's not what the left is talking about when they're talking about diversity, when they're talking about multiculturalism. Because they've never called for, hey, let's bring in people that'll destroy the values we have. How about that? No, they say, let's bring in as many people as we can from all different backgrounds and belief systems, etc., as long as they agree on the basic principles. And uh, again, the only way that Rick Santorum can muster up an argument against a Democrat or muster up an argument against President Obama is to make something up. So he makes something up, and in the process of it, he doesn't even realize that his argument is also against himself.